I thought, no, it's not a UFO. And then I looked carefully at it, it and I thought, maybe. And I saw this person. And it had big eyes. That's all I saw about it, big eyes. It was scary myself. It was scary because you saw something yourself? Yes. Mm -hmm. I saw little objects hovering. It was quite big, actually, and then there was little ones all around it. I think they want um, people to know that we're actually making harm on this world and we mustn't get too technologed. My heart kind of went faster and then slower and then faster and then slower mm -hmm. all at the same time. His eyes looked at me as if, oh, I, w I want to... Um, like that. I want to what? I want you. I want you. Yeah. This is Emma. Oh, Emma. Christian sent you. Yes, because your drawing uh, was particularly interesting. Uh, they have asked me about it. Uh, you saw in your drawing, you've got not only the main uh, object there, but you've got several others. Now, did you see these coming down? Or did you no. see them in the sky? I saw them I saw them disappear. They went one meter up from the ground and then they just disappeared. They went one meter up and they disappeared. And this this you saw this creature? Yes, she was very, very shiny black. Shiny black? Shiny black. Suit. Kind of suit. Would you say it was like a, a ordinary suit that uh, was it like what Mr. Mackey's wearing? No. What would you call the type of clothing? I'm not sure, but he was really... Have you ever seen the diver staring to the sea? Oh, yes, like that. Was like it like that. that, or was it like an overall? Or a tight-fitting suit? It was tight-fitting. It was tight-fitting, and it was shiny. Yes. Could you see his face? Well, I only saw a glimpse of it. And you don't remember any individual features? Well... Uh, I only remember that his eyes were quite big. Eyes were big. And were you afraid? I was a little afraid. What did you think it was? I don't know. I just thought it was some kind of alien from a different planet. So you knew about the UFOs? Yes. You watched on television? Yes. Do you think that influenced you? Mm. Or you weren't thinking about it? I wasn't thinking no. about okay. it. Okay. Thanks, Emma. I saw one big one and then quite a few little ones scattered all around. How many of quite a few? Mm. About two uh, or three or about four? Four. About four. And what were the little ones doing? No, they were they were very still and then I saw them also disappear. They went about a meter off the ground and then they just vanished. And what happened to the big one? The big one did the same. Where did Emma see it? I thought, well, I was standing over there when I moved over there because a few children were scared, but I moved over there and I saw the same one, but um, you could see it from both directions. Okay. I've not spoken to anybody about it. Not because I'm not proud of it, but because I don't want the, the stigma. I don't want to say I felt like I knew it, but I knew that I didn't have to be afraid of yeah. it. They took us back to the moment of contact. Uh, exactly how I felt, I felt exactly. So. The details still seared into memory. I was with one of the other girls and saying to her, this is amazing. I kept getting these thoughts and ideas in my mind of technology. Technology is not helping, technology is bad. As soon as I broke contact, all of those feelings, technology, the bad, the horribleness that was happening and, and going around my body at the time went. 